it's grocery day, it's grocery day. We're so excited, it's grocery day, it's grocery day, it's grocery day. We're so excited, it's grocery day. Yeah! Hello, Alyssa here. Welcome to my channel, or welcome back. In case you didn't know, we get really excited about grocery day around here. <laughs> um, so here are my groceries. We didn't get as much this time. I really didn't get much for meals. I basically just got mostly the staples and a few extra little treats. So I'm going to unpack all of this and I'll show you what I've got. Um, just so you know, we eat near paleo, gluten-free. We are a family of four. It's me, my husband, a three-year-old, and an eight-month-old. You'd be surprised by how much an eight-month-old can eat. I think he eats more than a three-year-old. <laughs> so, let me show you. So, this little man's awake and going to join me. First, I'm going to show you the frozen foods so that I can go ahead and get those in the freezer and then we'll do refrigerated and pantry produce. So to start, we have brick oven pizzas. My husband likes these, and these make a couple of lunches extra easy for me. And then we have gluten-free waffles. <laughs> They're upside down. Gluten-free waffles, and some gluten-free chicken nuggets. My daughter has a wheat allergy, which is why we do gluten-free things. And these, I mean, it's summertime, and we have a pool, and doesn't that look yummy? Mm -hmm. um, I can't believe, <laughs> I can't believe that's all the frozen items I have. This is for two weeks. This is a two week grocery haul. But again, it's just some of the staples. I got a lot of items for meals, for meals that I planned for last time. And I'll link that, that um, grocery haul in the description box for you. The meals are stretching a lot longer, a lot further than I thought. So all I really needed was the staples this time. So that's why we don't have a whole lot for this two week grocery haul. Um, but I have to tell you what, I'm saving so much money going bi-weekly with groceries. Okay, I have to get this in the freezer. I'll be right back. <laughs> okay, so for refrigerated items, we have orange juice. Eowyn loves orange juice, don't you? Mm-hmm. And then we have lactose-free milk for my husband. Got him a couple of those. Boy. Landry's trying to film. You trying to do it? And then I have five almond milks. These are half gallons, and we absolutely use that much in two weeks. I could have used another this past week, so. Okay, okay. I probably should have bought six, but we'll just make five work again this time. Um, and so that's all the refrigerated items I have. So I did get some shampoo this time. I'm out of that. And necessity, I ran out of coffee today. So praise the Lord. Folgers Black Silk is my favorite. We have some tea bags to make some iced tea for my husband. He likes sweet tea. We're in the South, y'all. Peanut butter. I mean, when I'm talking staples, it's peanut butter and banana and apples. Like, we can live off that for forever. And I've been saving these jars, and I've been drinking out of it. Let me show you. <laughs> this is a peanut butter jar. <laughs> and I've been drinking my water out of it. I love it. Bananas. I usually get a whole lot more, but I have some bananas frozen in the freezer. So, I just got a, a bit less this time blueberries, strawberries, we can just eat those up. And I also put them in my oatmeal in the morning. Apples, apples and peanut butter is a go-to snack for us. And we got a tiny little watermelon. Isn't that cute? It's gonna be so yummy. We got Honey Nut Cheerios and regular Cheerios. Um, Eowyn likes these and Lander um, is starting to be able to eat them too. I love whenever babies reach the age that like, whenever they get fussy, you can just give them a couple Cheerios. <laughs> and that is where we're at. We are at Cheerio stage. That's exciting for me, you know? Um, is there anything else? That's all of it. I can't believe that's all that I have for this grocery haul. <coughs> Y'all right, girl? Um, if you, if your staples are similar to mine, 
I would like to know. If they are way different, tell me, what do you get? What are your staples? What are your go-to must-haves? For me, it's bananas, peanut butter, almond milk, apples. I mean, basically what you just saw. Also, oats. I have a whole thing of old-fashioned oats, so I didn't need to buy that this time. Yeah, and we can just go a while on those things. Um, especially since that we have like meat and stuff for recipes for dinners already that we didn't use up from last time. So we will finish up last grocery hauls meals and then we'll just kind of eat whatever we can find in the pantry and hopefully we'll make it another two weeks until our next grocery haul. If you enjoyed this, make sure you subscribe for more. And I did say last video that I was going to give I was gonna show what I was making with all the stuff in that haul and I haven't done that and I apologize. I just, I end up forgetting to film whenever I'm cooking. I need to get in the swing of that, you know? So maybe with the last meals that I have um, to cook from that haul, I will film. Uh, we'll just see what happens. Anyways, I look forward to getting to know in the comments. Be sure to let me know who you are and what you eat. <laughs> And I will see you soon. Bye. Oh no, say bye bye. Bye bye. You want to say bye? What? What the? <laughs> oh, that was Lander. Lander said that. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> You're so silly. <laughs>